Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel. In the previous video, we have seen how to attach the token for the HTTP request or so the outgoing HTTP request, how to attach the auth token we have seen, right? But here, if you see, we will be finding some problem here, not a problem. So we can do in a very smart way. How we can do is, we have already learned about the interceptors, Axios interceptors in our previous video courses. In our previous videos, we have seen the Axios interceptor. Why can't we use this Axios interceptor and add this auth token automatically, whenever, uh, automatically to the outgoing HTTP request, so that whenever we are making Axios request to a particular URL, happened automatically the auth thing the token so automatically to the url so how can how can we use the like that interceptors thing let's try to see in this video okay so here we are attaching this auth token right now what we can see as we learn in the axios interceptors uh, how we can write the axios interceptors so here we can write this one axios so here i can write something like axios dot interceptors dot for the request we are writing right request dot use and here you will be having the config and if you try to see console.log config so for every request you are making so you are able to do you will be able to check this one so for example if i try to uh, refresh this one okay if you are trying to make if you are trying to refresh so if i go to the console you will be able to see this config from the main.js you are able to get the config in the config you are having the url what is the url you are trying to make so question mark auth is equal to you are able to get and also if you go to the login so here also you are able to get the so if i try to submit test at the rate test.com or something like this if i do and here i am able to get the again that main.js i am able to get see the request i am able to get so now if i want to append the query parameters to here what can i do let params is equal to new url search params okay so here i can write params dot append sorry append of something like hi and here i can write leela so key value pair and append this config dot params is equal to params and return this config okay so return this config so this is the how we can write this interceptor let's try to see so if i go into this one and if i try to see the network here if you try to see for this post thing so automatically hi is equal to lila is getting attached instead of auth is equal to it is which is attaching in the component itself so we are writing in the component itself that one so it is just instead of uh, doing this one this one is getting appended percent like this it is going to be appended okay so this is the, what the thing we need to have so fine now if i go to the login here and if i do the login so at the rate something.com and if i write some like this and if i click on login for this sign up also we are able to see that ampersand high is equal to relay is going to be attached okay so for the sign up and the login we don't want this interceptor to run we want to run interceptor except for the sign up and login or whatever the urls you want to don't run the don't attach this auth token so you need, you don't want to run this interceptor but here if you write here in the main.js for the global axios it will run for entire interceptors one thing what we can do is here we can check with the condition if config.url like this we can write so it doesn't match to the set of urls please don't run this one or otherwise run run like that we can do and another another easiest way another smart way how we can do is we can remove this one all okay and go to the services and create an axios token instance okay dot js file so create a separate instance axios and here what i can do const so here i can do export default axios instance okay so i will do this one and here what i can write constant axios instance or instead of writing like this it will be confused for you so import axios from axios let's import the axios here and here let's create constant axios sorry axios instance i will create an instance axios dot create so empty object if you want to pass some parameters you can pass so the configuration you can pass you base url by fixing the base url and all the things passing the headers and all the things now here what i can do 
for this axios instance dot interceptors dot request dot use and in this one we will be getting the config in this config what i will try to do let params is equal to new url such params okay so params dot append and i can write here so just we will try to check here just i will try to add this one hi leela okay later on we will add the token so params sorry config config dot params is equal to params and return this config okay so this is the thing and here let export default this axios instance okay so this is the new instance so wherever you want to append you want to use this interceptor so you want to add this auth token or anything so we need to use this one for example here in the post dot view i need to add, add append the auth token so now i instead of using this axios i can use import axios instance what are the name you want you can keep it here so i instead of importing from the axios i will import it from the services slash axios token instance now what i need to call so instead of using calling with this axios i can call it the axios instance dot get now if you try to see the output here the axios is different not in main.js okay fine so now here let's go to the main.js and here let's remove this axios okay now if i go and if i try to refresh okay we have refreshed this one now if you see ampersand auth is equal to and high is equal to lila has been appended this is appended through the interceptor now if i go to the login okay if i go to the login and if i try to do test at the rate test.com okay one two three four five six if i do like this if i click on the login see now here no ampersand high is equal lila has been attached so that means for this post it has been attached i think if you see able to see high is equal lila has been attached here at the down you can you will be able to see this one so now for the sign up and so forever whatever the axios urls you want to atta attach this token you can use this token instance instead of using directly the axios library okay so this axios library will be written imported here and we will be doing some modifications so this is the best way so wherever you want to use you can use directly this axios instance and you can do whatever the axios you want you can do and here i can remove this token directly now what i will try to do here in this token instance i will try to attach this con token thing how can i attach this token so here what i can do auth and we have a getters so here this dot dollar store will not work as i already told you in the navigation guards same video so here what we need to do import store from store sorry store so we need to import store slash store dot js sorry store dot js okay so we need to import the store and now how we can get the <coughs> token so here let token is equal to store dot getters of okay so it is present in the auth namespace auth module slash okay sorry slash and here you need to you, you need to use the constant so there is nothing but what you can say token underscore get underscore token get underscore token underscore user underscore token getter okay so this is the name now this token you can directly use it down here okay so if you have only this one you can use like this so but we are present in the auth module right so auth slash like this we need to make sure. so dot getters we have got right token we have appended now let's try to see the output now if i remove if i try to do if i go to the login and if i add this one test at the rate test dot com and one two three four five six if i do if i click on login so now we are able to get the token c so now i am successfully able to add this token but through the interceptor so here i didn't added anything in the post dot view here i didn't added anything the auth token but i added in the interceptor so here store dot getters from the store store i am getting the token and i am able to successfully add this token okay so this is how we will be appending this token okay this is how we will be doing uh, through the interceptor how we can append the token auth token through the interceptors okay hope you understood about this axios instancing if you have doubt in this axios things and all those things so i have already covered this in this course only vjs course only about the axios how to do how to write the interceptors and all those things kindly you can go and you can refer to that videos okay
so if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you